Hello YouTube. In this video I'm going to show you how to actually go in and manually configure an application to either be blocked or allowed through the Windows firewall. So if you're running Windows 10 the first thing you want to do is right click on the start button and go to control panel. Now if you're running Windows 7 you'll have to click on the start button right click on computer and go to it that way. Once you're in control panel, if you're in this particular category view right here, go up here to view by and click large icons. Then you can scroll down to the bottom, click on Windows Firewall, and you can see here that the firewall is turned on and blah blah blah. So let's say you're wanting to run a Minecraft server or something like that and you need to allow Java W.exe through the firewall. Well, what you're going to do is you're going to come down here to advanced settings and then you're going to click on inbound rules and then you're going to click over here on new rule on the far right. You're going to select, leave it on program. You can change it to port, predefined or custom, however you want to set it up. But for this, since it's going to be an application, set it on program, hit next. And then this program path, click browse. Do not use all programs that could be very, very dangerous for your system. Now you're going to browse to where your Java 64-bit is installed. Java. Bin. And then you're going to look for Java WEXE. Click Open. Once you select the file and hit Open, it'll come to this page again. Hit Next. You're going to leave it on Allow the Connection. If you want to completely block it, you can hit Block the Connection. It'll completely block the application from getting through. Hit next. You can leave all of them selected or select only the one you want. It's best if you're opening it up to leave all of them selected. And then for this we're going to say Minecraft server. Or you can just put in Java W either way. Click finish and it adds the exception to the firewall. So now to do the same thing for outbound so the connection can go out, you click on the outbound rules, hit new rule, leave it on program and hit next. Browse, this time it'll take you straight to the folder you were just in, click on the Java WEXE. Once it, you click open, it'll come back to this again with the program path displayed, click next. And then it'll automatically go to block the connection as default. You want to select allow the collection, connection, click next, leave all applied and then put in Minecraft server and click finish and you now have a custom rule that allows through the firewall that particular application to remove it right well to you can just say right click and hit disable rule which will uncheck it and it's no longer used or you can right click and hit delete rule and that's how you allow an application uh, that you want to go through the firewall access to go through or to be able to block it completely and not allow any connections in or out through the application. This information is out there for absolutely everybody. As always, watch, like, and share. Have yourselves a great day.